The monolithic financial scam that we call the Federal Reserve was born in 1913. But did you know that the foundation for this fiat-based inflationary fiasco was laid by one of our most celebrated founding fathers? Alexander Hamilton was his name. He's been glorified on Broadway and beyond. But as the first Treasury Secretary, Hamilton convinced Congress to take unprecedented liberty with the newly ratified Constitution of the United States. He centralized power by forming a national bank, modeled after the mother of all financial corruption, the Rothschild Bank of England. And he did it to pay off revolutionary war debts. Does this pattern sound familiar? Secretary of State Thomas Jefferson vehemently opposed the plan foreseeing it would lead to tyranny and enslavement through debt. Hamilton won out, and you know the puppet masters play the long game. At the same time, Hamilton the Musical broke a billion dollars in revenue on Broadway. Thomas Jefferson was being canceled by cities nationwide. There's irony for you.